Hello, uh, I'm running this FPGA board now. Uh, I see 40HX8K slash uh, minus EVB from Olimex. Uh, and uh, you can control it using the keyboard here. So it now this FPGA is a VGA card and also controlled by the keyboard. So now I go up here and left. So and it can bounce too against the red frame. Uh, I was interested in this because someone made a uh, uh, Apple One clone using this FPGA. Then they have the whole uh, uh, 6502 processor in uh, the FPGA and all other circuits too. Uh, perhaps RAM is external. I'm not uh, looked into it so deeply yet. Um, you can look at it here now. So uh, uh, this board is not connected now, it only takes power from this, so it goes on 5 volt. Uh, I don't have any uh, ground here, but it's grounded through the monitor cable. And then uh, we have this uh, FPGA board here, and the FPGA circuit here. Maybe this is some RAM or something, maybe I'm not sure. And then it has buttons and LEDs here. And then this board here is uh, the, uh, see if I can switch off the light. Uh, uh, that's uh, for VGA and uh, keyboard and also IRDA, so you can communicate with infrared light in and out. And then it has an uh, extension here where you can connect other things. Uh, so I bought this mainly to learn FPGA because I think it's cool that you can create digital circuits just by writing code and downloading it uh, yourself without having a factory or anything. Um, then uh, uh, I used uh, WSL, VSL, uh, Ubuntu from Windows Store in order to uh, 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 compile this and build this ice storm. It's using only open source tools here in Linux. And then uh, I use this. Uh, uh, it's an Arduino Leonardo, but of Olimex style, that I used to program it. And uh, I could demonstrate that now. So I connect this cable here, programming cable, uh, like so. And then uh, now we, we I should make some video about this especially, but uh, uh, because I don't have Zoom here, but I can compile it here using winicepogduino.exe and then a minus i com5 example bin. Wow, now there is some error here. Uh, I don't know. Seems if we try some reset from the different things here, maybe this will work. So now uh, maybe I could try again here to program it. See if this works now. 
Uh, it's the same strange thing again. I don't know what this is. Hmm. But it has never happened before like that. Uh, I think I have everything to check here. Maybe you can't do it like that. Okay, if I disconnect everything. Maybe I destroyed it now. Well, it still works, but uh, can I program it? That's the question here. Ah, it seems to work now to program. So uh, you might see that it moves a bit here when it programs. Um, now the screen is gone too. <clears throat> I could not uh, get programming to work from inside VSL. Uh, not with this uh, X program and not uh, with the Linux program also. Because uh, I do know uh, COM5 is uh, a TES5 in uh, Linux, but it still didn't work. It, it worked somewhat for testing. I could read out this Winboard serial flash code. But I could not uh, program it. But now this has uh, reprogrammed and works again here. Uh, so this will be fun to learn here now that it works very well. I also tested some simpler demo that just blinks the LEDs. But uh, I think this VGA demo is more funny. Uh, it doesn't cost that much. Uh, about uh, four to five euro uh, for this card here and then this is not very expensive just a bunch of connectors and then this I owned from before it's uh, an Arduino clone Leonardo uh, and then you have a special program here on this so you can use it as a uh, flash uh, or this uh, uh, the FPGO programmer. Okay, bye for now. I should show other programs further on.